We, the Christians, always ask ourselves what we are free from when we are in Christ. Jesus Christ came to our world having a flesh like ours to free us from the law of sin and death. St. Paul in his epistle to the Romans chapter 8 explained it clearly saying, There is therefore now no condemnation for those who are in Christ Jesus, who walk not according to the flesh, but according to the Spirit. For the law of the Spirit of life in Christ Jesus has set me free from the law of sin and death. He also stated this law in chapter 6, For the wages of sin is death. So we are spiritually dead if we continue sinning. He made it so clear for us in Romans chapter 8 so that we understand clearly why Jesus came to us. He came to set us free from the slavery of sin and death. So we must no longer have to fear death because we are now free from bondage to sin. Jesus said in the Gospel of John chapter 8, I tell you the truth, everyone who sins is a slave to sin. We must know that when we continue sinning and obeying the devil's will in our lives, he, the devil, will have a grip on our will and he will enslave us. Sin can become more powerful than our will to resist it. We will be slaves to him. St. Paul has pointed to us the solution to how to be free from the power of sin, saying, For we know that our old self was crucified with him so that the body of sin might be rendered powerless, that we should no longer be slaves to sin, because anyone who has died has been freed from sin. When we do not obey the will of the flesh and obey the will of Christ, our Lord and Savior, submitting and surrendering our lives and our will to Him, we will have his power over sin and we will be set free. Thanks to our Godfather's salvation plan to all mankind in his Son, Jesus Christ. Amen.